Hi guys, um, so in this video, uh, I just want to show the different startup screens for the Android TV boxes. And I apologize in advance for the, the poor quality video. Usually I remote in, so you've got the, the screen share from the Android boxes. However, in this case, since uh, I'm actually going to do a power down, uh, when I show you the different screens and how to change between the different screens, uh, I wanted to, to show uh, just a a live video with the, the TV here. So what we are going to do is uh, just gonna go down and if you can see my cursor I'm going to the settings here. If you're in this launcher and you and you say hey um there's the I want the I want the media box launcher. I don't want this this launcher in the screen um, because the the other one is a little more common. Um, however sometimes you get a box and it has this startup screen when you when you turn it on and you may be thinking hey why don't I see all the the icons in the same setup that I see other places um, you may also see part of the screen off the screen that's just uh, changing the, the magnification um, the zoom uh, we can change that as well but uh, the main thing is so I just wanted to settings the main thing is the the home screen so if you go down to device and home click on home then it gives you these two options so there's the launcher screen and you can see that the button is highlighted there, so that's that's what it's been starting at. And then there's the media back box launcher, and that's the the little more common, typical screen with the larger icons that you are probably used to. So if you select that, and you you now the button is highlighted there. Um, now you go out, and you may be thinking, oh, how come it's still on the launcher screen, not the media box launcher screen? Well. Uh, you've either got to, you can do the, you can restart the box or um, it might be even faster just to, to do a power down. So, um, when you restart the box back up, do when you restart the box back up, you will see the media box launcher screen now. And this is just this is just a standard MXQ box. Um, this can happen with any of the boxes. The screens may look slightly different if you have different versions of Android, but here we have the media box screen. Now, uh, I'll just show you two other quick things here as well. Um, in this box, uh, this is also something that commonly happens when you, you get a new box and, hey, where's Cody? Um, I don't see Cody. All I see is, you know, this, uh, this little Android guy that's, uh, that's going to check for the installed apps and I don't see anything there. Um, I've got this play button and this, this where's, where's Cody? I want Cody or I want Showbox. Well, what you have to do is you actually go into the My Apps and then down here, you could pick Cody. So I could launch Cody from here. However, if you want a shortcut button, then that's when you hit the, the plus sign here and you could pick Cody or whatever, whatever other apps you want to personalize and show up. And sometimes it doesn't register. That does happen. I'm gonna do that one more time, go back out. And there, now there's the Cody button. And one more thing I'll show you quickly is the, the screen size. So if you go into settings and this, uh, display position, then you can see the, the zoom here. So if, if you're getting parts of the screen that are cut off, then you can change that. Here. Anyways, uh, yeah, I don't, I don't like to get my videos to go too long. So if you like the channel, subscribe. And if you have any comments, uh, let me know. If you have any other questions for some of the, the initial boxes that you get and, and start up, then please post them below and I'll, I'll try to answer them for people. Thanks. Have a good one.